Hi guys, so I'm back with another video. I'm gonna be showing you guys how I did these jade nails. I'm so sorry that the video took so long for me to get up, y'all. I've been busy. I've been busy, y'all. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all how I did these jade nails. They're pretty easy. This is my first time ever doing jade nails and they turned out really good. Um, so now I'm gonna show y'all the colors that I'm gonna be using. Um, this first color I got, I got this color from Nail Supply Glamour, but it's discontinued. It's like this translucent baby blue color. Um, I don't think they carry it anymore, but I'm pretty sure it's pretty easy to make. All you need is like a baby blue color and just dilute it with some clear. This next color is this dark green color. I made this color myself. Um, it's like a dark green, like a camouflage color something like that next color is like this baby blue turquoise color well it's not really baby blue it's more like turquoise but like a pastel turquoise so those are the three colors i'll be using for this set and you're also going to need some gold flakes and you'll see that later on in the video Okay guys, so basically what I'm doing now, um, for all your nails, you just want to go in with that first color, that light pastel baby blue color, and cover the whole entire nail. It's okay if it's translucent or a little bit of clear in some areas, it's totally fine. It's, it's a very pastel, very light color, so it's fine if it's a little clear in some areas. So after you finish applying that color and smoothing it out, you want to go in. I use a smaller brush for the second step um, with the second color. I use like a probably a number four, number two or something. So I go in with that second color, that turquoise color, and I use very wet beads. For when you make your lines for marbling or doing jade nails or whatever, you want to use very wet beads. You want to make sure you're your brush is very wet as well so I'm going in with very wet beads and I'm just spreading it out you can use a reference photo like find a photo online or you can use my photo but to do that first set I, I didn't use photo I just played around with the lines until I was satisfied with it so just play around with the lines till you till you like the finished outcome so I was just playing around with the lines until I like it and once I did that I went in with the third color So the same thing with the third color, um, basically you just using wet beads, make sure your brush is wet, making these lines. I go at an angle, um, like diagonal, and make my lines, especially for the darker color. Um, I do go over uh, that second color with the darker color, but not too much that it won't show. You don't want to completely cover it up with the darker color. You still want that, that light color to still show like on the edges, you know? So I just go ahead and do that and I go at an angle when I make my lines. I don't go like straight. I never do straight lines. I don't really recommend doing straight lines for marble because marble, if you look at the pictures, they're all going in different angles. So, and if you do need to go back in with the light color, you can definitely do that. Just make sure your beads is wet. Okay, now it's time for the gold flakes. Um, I just get a chunk of gold flake and I just put it on the nail. And all I do to break it up is just have a wet brush and it breaks it right on up. So you don't really need to tear it in pieces because I know that can be, it can be irritating for me. Like tearing up little pieces of gold flakes and it'd be flying everywhere. So I just get a piece, put it on my brush and spread it out with the monomer. And after you do that, you're going to go in and cap the entire nail. Okay guys, so I'm just going to show y'all the process again one more time on how to do the marbling again.
Okay y'all, so this is the finished results after I capped the nails and top coated them with file buff and top coat. Um, I hope you guys like this video. I'm so sorry it took so long. I wanted to do like a video with how I do all my marbling, but that was going to be a super duper long video and that's what we not finna do. I don't know about y'all, but I don't like watching long videos. I don't but yeah I wanted the video to be like short so I'm gonna make another video on how to do like black and white marble and colored marble and water watercolor marbling or whatever and all that all, all that good stuff it'll be coming so real soon but yeah guys I hope you guys like this video please like comment share and subscribe follow me on Instagram Twitter snapchat all that and I'll see y'all my next video bye